Hello, today we are going to learn how to locate the inverse points of any given point with respect to a given circle. Let's start with the definition of inversion. The inversion is a transformation which transforms one point A into its inverse point A prime, whose distances from the origin O equals the square of the radius and satisfies the equation R squared equals OA times OA prime, which can be seen on the top left of the screen. In our video today, we are going to locate the inverse of three different given points. One point A, which is located inside the given circle. One point B, which is located outside the given circle. And finally, one point C, which is located on the circumference. Okay, let's start with the given point A inside the given circle with origin O. So the first step is to join point O with A and elongate this line as shown here in the video. So to continue, we are going to draw a perpendicular line from point A until it cuts the circumference at a new point, which we will call point P. And now we join the origin O with the new point P. From the new radius OP, we draw a perpendicular line until it cuts our previously elongated line at a new point, which we will call A prime. And this new point A prime is the inverse of point A, which satisfies the equation R squared is equal to OA times OA prime. So the next step, we are going to locate the inverse point of the point B, which we can see located outside of the circle. So the first step is to join point B with the origin O. The next step is to work out the perpendicular bisector of the line segment BO. So to do this, we set our compass on the origin O and with a radius slightly longer than half the line segment BO, we're going to describe an arc above and below the line. And now with the same radius and setting the compass on point B, we're going to describe two new arcs, cutting our previously drawn arcs. As shown here. And now we will draw a line joining these two intersections and it cuts our line BO at half and getting a new midpoint M, which we will call M. So now setting our compass on point M and with a radius MO, we're going to draw a construction circle which cuts our given circle at two new points, which we will call Q and S. The next step is to join points Q and S, and where this line cuts the line BO, we obtain a new point B prime, which is the inverse point of the point B and satisfies the equation R squared is equal to OB times OB prime. And finally, to find the inverse point of C, which is located on the circumference, when you join the origin O to C, it is the same distance as the radius R. Therefore, R squared is equal to OC times OC prime, which is the same as OC squared. So I hope this video has helped you. Please press like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you would like to, you can always support us uh, by pressing the super thanks button. Until the next video, thank you very much.